American Cancer Society has the following guidelines for cervical cancer screenings. Women ages 21 through 29 should get a pap test every three years, and women ages 30 through 65 can either get the pap every three years or get the pap test and HIV, HIV, HPV test every five years. So what is the HPV test? How is that different from getting a, a screening? So the HPV test is a, is a test looking for um, the genetic material of the HPV virus itself. Mm -hmm. So the pap test obtains cells from the outside of the cervix, so it obtains cytology. Whereas the HPV test is a test for the virus itself. They're collected at the same time. The genetic material or the DNA of the virus is extracted from the fluid in which okay. the cells are obtained, but they are different tests and they look at different things. And you collect this during the pap spare? Correct. Okay, and would someone in their 20s need an HPV test? Absolutely, in fact, we typically now do co-testing. The issue with the younger age group is that, as we had mentioned earlier, there's such a high prevalence of HPV that it may not necessarily be as sensitive as in the older age group in terms of predicting whether that patient uh, is going to de develop the precancerous lesions that are associated with cervical cancer.